The date is August 29th, 2022, and the Arizona Diamondbacks have called up Corbin Carroll, who landed as the number one midseason prospect for both ESPN's Kylie McDaniel and the Athletics' Keith Law. Carroll missed the majority of last season, only playing in seven games, before he injured his right shoulder on a home run swing. Thankfully, that was his non-throwing shoulder. While rehabbing, Carroll showed up to the Major League ballpark every single game to sit with advanced scout Jeff Gardner to learn the ins and outs of the game. He is praised for having a very high baseball IQ. And let's see what he's got. Top of the first, first batter of the ball game, Kyle Schwarber is up. And he promptly skies one to deep right, sending Carroll to the track. That's no problem. Whew. Welcome to the majors. Later on in the inning, we've got Bryce Harper up against Bumgarner. Two runners on. And that's a shot 113 miles per hour into right field past a sliding Carroll. Kind of looked like it might have eaten him up there. And the relay in. No chance. Let's see that again. Ooh, Carroll going down to his knees, not quite able to catch up to that ball. Just hit a little too hard. Next inning, top two, Schwarber up again, punches one through to the right side, and take a look at Carroll's arm. Not exactly a rifle. It really might be the only non-stellar aspect of his game. Moving on to bottom three, Carroll's first major league at bat, Ranger Suarez, a left-hander on the mound. And that's a sinker inside corner for strike one. Setting up on the inside, another sinker, this time off the plate, one and one. Carroll did most of his damage in the minor leagues versus right-handers, but he was no slouch against lefties. The one, one, that's another sinker at the knees. And that's a four seam again at the knees. And wow, he got up the line fast. Let's see that again. Not a huge guy, listed at 5'10", but man, does he fly up the line. And we've got Bryce Harper against Baumgartner again. And that's a shot down the line. Carroll gets there pretty quick, but take a look at where this cutoff man is. Pretty deep. You know, again, not the strongest arm. It seems like they're maybe trying to make up for that a little bit. Bottom four, Carroll's up again against uh, Ranger Suarez. And that's a sinker on the inside corner, fought off by Carroll. Suarez with another sinker, low and inside corner. And yet another sinker, misses inside, counts one and two. And that's another sinker. And Segura can't quite handle it, and Carroll beats the throw. It seemed like he was trying to maybe get the force at second and was just a little too preoccupied with the foot speed. Whew, man, he's fast. So that's two plate appearances by Carroll. He's seen eight pitches, and they've all been fastballs. We see Carroll's moved on to second. Carson Kelly punches one into the right field corner. And look at Carroll go. And that's going to clear the bases. Carroll up again, bottom five. Ranger Suarez has been chased from the game as the Diamondbacks have clawed back from a 7-0 deficit and are now tied at seven. Christopher Sanchez misses outside with a sinker. Sinker again on the outside. Gets a bit of a friendly call there, one and one. Another sinker. That's low and out of the zone. 2-1. Good hitters count here for Carroll. Sanchez delivers, another sinker. Carroll fights it off. And that's a slider on the outside half of the plate, and Carroll doesn't try to do anything fancy. He goes with it and dumps it into left field. And it doesn't get to the wall, but Carroll has made it to second base. Family loves it. Carroll loves it. Let's see Corbin Carroll's first major league knock again. Solid line drive, almost splits the outfielders, but Brandon Marsh in center field is able to catch up to it. 
And that's a stand-up double. Cooper Hummel and Alec Thomas giving him the flex. And Carroll with the flex back. <laughs> Carroll is now on third. And Cattell Marte draws the bases loaded walk. And that's another run for Carroll. Carroll up yet again, bottom six, facing his first right-hander of his career, Andrew Bellotti. And that is a fastball outside corner for a called strike. Way low. That's a change. Another change, low. Carroll's going to reset. Counts one and two. And that's a slider low, and Carroll is pretty badly fooled by that one. On to the bottom of the eighth. Sometime closer Brad Hand on the mound. That's a slider low for a ball. That's a two seam on the inside corner and low. One and one. Another breaking ball inside. Two one. And a two seam on the inside part of the plate. Handled by Gene Segura. And that's going to wrap it up for Corbin Carroll's Major League debut. I have a feeling we'll be seeing a lot of them in the future. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if you think it's worth it. Have a good one. It just it felt like another baseball game. You know, that was something that was shared to me with uh, uh -oh. <laughs> See how quick oh, he is? He's too quick. He's too quick. You can't even get him with the ice bucket. Oh, my God. Oh, my God.